home of the Super Bowl. And this historic matchup is brought to you by EA Sports. It's the Chiefs and the Vikings, and it comes your way next. EA Sports coverage of the National Football League is on the air. Tonight, EA Sports coverage of the National Football League is on the air. Tonight, it is all on the line. We play for the Lombardi Trophy, as it'll be the AFC champion, Kansas City Chiefs, taking on the champions from the NFC, the Minnesota Vikings. With Charles Davis, as always, I'm Brandon Gordon. Charles, you talk about storylines in this one. I think it begins and ends with our two quarters. And nowadays, I don't think you can get by for long periods of time without a top-flight quarterback. The way the game is played, with all the responsibility he has and how the game flows through him, if he's not on the top of his game, your team's not going to benefit at all. setting the pace, jumping out in front, that has to feel great for the entire organization. It's in seven plays. And finishing that drive off was the touchdown grab by Isaiah Likely. And he'll be brought down right on the chalk of the 20. So here's the Viking offense making their way out. And they'll be led out by their third-year quarterback. As we begin the Super Bowl, we are looking at one of the game's most important players. And whether he's the centerpiece of the offense or taking a backseat to his teammates from the get-go. They had everyone crashing the ball carrier before he even made the line, and they hold him to just a yard. Now a nice throw here right side. He hauls it in. And he'll be brought down with a first down as the tackle's made at the Chiefs' 31-yard line. A good pick up there, 26 yards. Well, I think when they look at their offense, they think to themselves, weapons, weapons everywhere. And they want to move the ball around. They want to spread it to different people. But you absolutely know they want to get this. And this may be a big early turning point in this Super Bowl. They're going to go for it on fourth down here. Back to throw. Din. It's complete. Swings it out to his running back. Touchdown, Vikings. Ty Chandler, 26 yards. And the Vikings are an extra point away from tying this Super Bowl at seven. Big fourth down. With a pair of motivated grooves. Remember, the offense scored a touchdown on their last time out. Looking to repeat that in Charles' defense. They were very frustrated after giving up six the last time on the field. And frankly, it's just a battle of wills in a lot of ways because you know they're both motivated. They both game plan for this drive. And they both have specific outcomes in mind. To me, it just comes down to who can execute better and which side can step up and assert its will over the other. Well, that's an excellent way to get the pass rush activated. The first sack. And the officials here are going to pause the game for a second. Looks like there's an injured chief on the field. We'll get an update when we come back to Miami. So here's a third and 14. 
Mahomes now to throw. Work in the middle of the field, and he's got a man complete. And he will have a Chiefs first down as they're able to get the third down conversion. Someone sharp in this game. I think they forced the incompletion. Now Mahomes. Uh, he had a man open, but he missed him, and it's incomplete. Give him credit for excellent coverage, tight coverage. They're doing a lot of things that we talk about in basketball. They're causing disruptions in the passing game. And as long as that continues, it'll be tough for them to gain any momentum throwing the ball downfield. And anytime you see a kicker try out the trial run for 56 yards, you know everything's got to come off perfectly. For Hands of Nichols. And this won't be enough to pick up the first. A gain of two, third and one. Now whistles and a timeout. Looks like we've got a Viking slow to get up. Third down and one. Ready. On the carry, it's Nichols. And he's going to get this down near the 20-yard line. It's a gain of 11 as the Vikings pick up the first. Usually we see runs like this as the deep defense breaks down later in the game, but this guy is setting the tone early, running through all types of tackles and putting the defense back on its heels. On first and ten, Din. He's got his man. It's taken in for a fucking touchdown. From 21 yards away. And the Vikings have taken the lead. And partner, they found a gap there on the post pattern, and it was in the middle third of the field. He's short by maybe a foot, maybe. Call it fourth and inches. Andy Reid, some say always unpredictable, and here he says, we're going for it on fourth down. They'll go for it. It's Mahomes. Pass taken in by his big tight end. And he'll be taken down as that will take us to the end of the first quarter of play. A lot still to go here in Super Bowl 61. We have reached the end of one quarter of play. One quarter of play. We'll be back in just a moment. 14-7 is the score. The NFL on EA Sports continues right after this message. And we are back, Super Bowl 61. Thanks for joining us, everybody, nationwide and around the globe as both teams get set to begin the second quarter. And they will take it on in for a Chiefs touchdown. Isaiah Pacheco, 34 yards. And the Chiefs, everybody, nationwide and around the globe as both teams get set to begin the second quarter. And they will take it on. Chiefs touchdown. Isaiah Pacheco, 34 yards. And the Chiefs are an extra point away from tying up this Super Bowl. So that CD, that was impressive. He got out of three, maybe four tackles there on his way to the end zone. And a lot of times when you break a tackle at base, and it worked awfully well. Got him not just space, but plenty of room to run after the catch to pick up really nice yardage. Here we go, Jack. Now a play fake here on first down. Open man, he's got Jefferson across the formation. 15 more there, and they're on a roll. It's another first down. Well, that certainly has to feel good. It's not a hard throw again. And that will be incomplete as well. Kansas City defense, tough to throw on there, and now it's fourth down. Chase McLaughlin now for the field goal try. That's just a 35-yard attempt from the left hash. And his kick is right there. It's good, and they take a 17-14 lead. So they're able to end that drive with three points in this one. to start the drive and just enough by about the length of the football for a first down. Now Mahomes. Open man is born. There he goes, right side. Still on his feet. Still fighting for more. And finally wrestled down at the eight-yard line. A big play there on the catch and run. 57 yards. That was an incomplete. A drop there in the middle third of the field. That'll bring up second down. Right up to that point, I was about to say, he's had a pretty good half catch in the football, but let's just be honest about it. He should have caught that one. And he knows that. That was one right in his bread basket and one he normally catches. 
Now Mahomes throwing on second down. And it's caught. And in for the Chiefs touchdown. Rasheed Rice from eight yards. He should have caught that one. And he knows that. That was one right in his bread basket and one he normally catches. Now Mahomes throwing on second down. And it's caught. And in for the Chiefs touchdown. Rasheed Rice from eight yards out. And the Chiefs are able to move back in front. Well executed there offensively. Defense looked a little confused, but he found his receiver, and that one good for six points. And the payoff we did. Oftentimes when you see a running back get bunched up in the backfield, it's usually because the defensive tackle is eating up blockers for others to make the play. Not in this case. Looking at a second and 11 now after the loss. Back to throw. Din. He finds his man complete. It's Russell. And he'll be brought down with a first down. And audible here to get a new look. Oh, and now movement and a whistle. And they may have to rethink their plans on fourth down. Now fourth and short, had your offense out there, that one stings. And you know something? Your options change dramatically. Not only is it tougher to go for it, but what if you decided just to line up and try and draw them off sides? If you did it on fourth and short, you could put that. Throwing to start the drive. Dim. And the Chiefs are going to get it. Chris Jones never giving up. He works his way to the QB for a loss of 12. But that's what they have to do more of defensively. Not just getting sacks, but they have to keep. And now a high kick here as they'll try to cover this one. Now a fair catch is called for and taken a few yards across midfield. So it's halftime here on Sports Grandest Stage in the Super Bowl. As we send you up to Orlando to check in with Jonathan Coachman at our EA Sports Halftime Report. Okay, Brandon, thanks very much. What a season this has been. Hard to believe it ends tonight. As we'll get back to you guys for the second stage in the Super Bowl. As we send you up to Orlando to check in with Jonathan Coachman at our EA Sports Halftime Report. Okay, Brandon, thanks very much. What a season this has been. Hard to believe it ends tonight. As we'll get back to you guys for the second half of this Super Bowl in just a moment. We got a strong first half out of the running back, Isaiah Pacheco. He had a touchdown run that helped get his guys this halftime lead. These two teams have had plenty of extra play to start the drive. Not much since. And this play will be blown up. He'll lose yardage back at the 38. A three-yard loss, fourth down now. So now on comes the field goal unit, and wow, this is no ordinary try here. This officially a 55-yard attempt, and he has got it from 55 yards away. That was never in doubt, and they have regained the lead. Well, they don't get a touchdown. A lot of times, the play caller, he just looks down at his sheet, sees the short yardage runs, and goes to one of those. Operating from the red zone now, Mahomes. And he's got his man in stride, complete. And the Chiefs are going to be set up with a first and goal coming up as they get him down at the six-yard line. I'll tell you what, this offense is playing a little bit of keep away right now. They've come out here in the third quarter, possessed the ball for quite a while, and they keep on converting. Again, they'll throw with Mahomes toward the end zone, but that's going to wind up incomplete. So it's been a long drive. They've held the ball for quite a while. Now what do you do here? Well, to me, at this stage after this drive, this close to the goal line, three points would be a let down. I'm going for it here. So two lead changes already in this third quarter. One side takes the lead with a field goal. The other takes it right. Off the play fake. Dent. That is caught by Dell. A big play there for Minnesota. 
47 yards. And the offense is saying to itself right now, only they were all this easy because he was wide open. And once he made the catch, plenty of room to work his way downfield. That was a breakdown on the defensive side of the ball. That was a breakdown on the defensive side of the ball. One that they want to fix immediately. So how about this for field position after the big play? Inside the 15 now as they come up on first and 10. Now a handoff up the middle. It's Nichols. And he'll get into the end zone. Touchdown, Minnesota. Taking it in from 11 yards out. And the Vikings have regained the lead in the second half of this Super Bowl. The offensive line for making it look easy. Yeah, I agree with you totally on that one. I'm not sure how much everyone understands the preparations that go into a game for an offensive line. Because there's a reason that running backs and quarterbacks give them big gifts at the end of the season after a big year. The consistency and the continuity it takes to know each other and execute their blocks is pretty impressive. It's complete. And he will find the end zone here. And the lead moves up to seven. And the official shy of the 30. It's another first down as they look his way again. This time 19 yards. And again, it's Mahomes. Now he tries to force it in, and it's intercepted. Picked by the linebacker, Brian Asamoah. And he will take this one home. It's a touchdown. Well, this defense, they force it in, and it's intercepted. Picked by the linebacker, Brian Asamoah. defense they've been terrific all year and they come through with a pick six here on the game's biggest stage perfect descriptor there because we have seen this time and time again this defense their ability to take the ball away from teams they definitely have a nose for the football and it pays off again on that one and it's incomplete when you're leading in the final quarter your radar has to be up for any potential deep shot and probably not the last one they're going to see in this game not as long as they hold this lead this offense was on the move. Now two straight incompletions have them looking at third and ten. Now Mahomes. And that is incomplete. We know it's not an easy job to go out and catch passes when people are trying to tackle you and knock the ball away. We know it's not an easy job to go out and catch passes when people are trying to tackle you and knock the ball away. But the bottom line is, that's a pass he's got to have and a pass he should have caught. The kick by Lutz is good. And then we'll get the disadvantage now back down to 11. So the three points there in CD, that helps him inch a bit closer. Yeah, partner, when you're losing any point yards as the Vikings pick up the first down. And I'm guessing you'd say this is kind of the key here. Grind out some yardage, work on that clock, see if you can continue to tick it down. Definitely, you want to bleed things out at this point, right? Continue to possess the football, gain some yardage, and put the onus... And intercepted! Maybe the turning point they need! Picked up by Nick Bolton. And the Chiefs are right back in this football game. That is the play they needed in a two-score game here in the fourth quarter. No, if I'm wrong, yeah, you're down two scores. I don't think you need to rush just yet, but you can't take your time either. Yeah, even if you don't want to commit to full two-minute offense, you have to up the tempo, up the urgency. Maybe you're starting to call two plays in a huddle each time you snap the ball. Touchdown! Rasheed Rice, his second touchdown of the Super Bowl. And the Chiefs have made it a one-score game again here in the fourth. I know Paul Revere talked about by land or by sea, right? And, you know, one by land or inside to create that separation and that little bit of space where there just isn't much. They go back to the air here after the INT on the last drive. And he's got this to Jefferson. And they work this well upfield across the 45. 23 yards, the final tally. These guys certainly are not hiding what their intention is. They're absolutely showing it. They're definitely not going to sit on this lead here in the fourth quarter. They go back to the air here after the INT on the last drive. And he's got this to Jefferson. And they work this well upfield across the 45. 
43 yards, the final tally. These guys say they're not hiding what their intention is. They're absolutely showing it. They're definitely not going to sit on this lead here in the fourth quarter. Line of scrimmage, again the four-yard line, second and goal. 18, five in. Ready. Back to throw. Dim. And this is caught. And that could seal it. It's a touchdown. What a huge touchdown that was, obviously, here in the late stages of the fourth quarter as they try to put this one away. And, Brandon, when they watch the film after this one, touchdown that was, obviously, here in the late stages of the fourth quarter as they try to put this one away. And, Brandon, when they watch the film after this week, they'll be very proud of every rep if they close this game out. Just a few snaps remaining. They can't relax just yet. McLaughlin for the extra point. And oh, it's wide right. No good. Tackle is made at the Vikings' 15-yard line. Now another timeout called for by the offense as they get the stoppage with a little over 50 seconds left to go in the game. Mahomes. And he takes this one into the end zone and all of a sudden, here in the final minute, things get a little bit tighter. Okay, game on. Don't go anywhere yet. You got a one-score game now. Get that high hop and hope that one of the guys can come up with it. And on the other side, get that hands team ready. No doubt about it. That's called. And he will get into the end zone as a two-point conversion is successful. And the lead is down to a field goal here in the fourth.